welcome to my channel. Um, I am going to drop a video very soon about the takeaways that Sussex Squad has gotten from Samantha Markle's rancid deposition. She looked crazy. And of course, Megan, as always, came across as diplomatic, warm-hearted, kind-spirited, because that's the person that she is. Samantha Markle is making a humiliation of herself at the firm and the trashy UK tabloid media's expense, but it's okay, girl. Just keep digging that hole even deeper. It's okay. But before I come to you with that video, I'm hoping to release that video by tomorrow. I did just want to take this time and read you guys some of the comments on my video supporting the successes, Prince Harry and his beautiful, lovely, warm-spirited, kind-hearted, humanitarian wife, Meghan Markle. Lord, these people are so, these crusty cronies are so jealous, hateful. They hate to see these two people succeed outside of the UK. And it just points to the problem of the hateful rhetoric that the UK tabloids push. The in the hate that they incite, you know, the, the, the misogyny, the xenophobia, the racism. I, I just, it is hilarious to watch this devolve into a ball of insanity. So, Guys, let's just read through some of these comments. Tomorrow, I will come to you with a video about Samantha Markle, but just listen to this. And uh, if you have not already, go ahead and click that like and subscribe button. Hit the smash, the, the, the bell, so that you'll know whenever I post a video. And thank you for being here. Mm. So let's get into it. First, I would take this time to go ahead and say that this channel renounces all forms of trolling, abuse, harassment, bullying, and it will not be tolerated. In order to highlight that, I will take a couple of seconds here to go ahead and read some of the highly intelligent and smart comments that the derangers have left in these videos talking about Harry and Meghan Markle and how they have been wronged. So let's go ahead and read some of these wonderful comments. So, <laughs> I'm gonna have to read this in the voice that just comes to me creatively. So, um, yeah, these are probably a lot of racist and xenophobic British people. Just from me fearing what this looked like, probably a few conservative, uh, far right Americans thrown in there too. I can't do the English accent very well, so a lot of these will, sorry, sound like redneck kicks. But let's go ahead and read some of these. Your Black Lives Matters is a scam ripped off of your own people. Uh, I, I, I won't even speak to the, um, the typos and the misspellings in some of these people's comments, but I shall continue. I digress and I shall continue. Hey, you don't even know what you are talking about, and it's them to dives who bring it on themselves. They're the ones who keep running to Scrooby, a new stick to talking about what you actually know don't map yourself like a mug. People just saw from that dog she is as black as your tree. It is all about the narrative with them. And if you blev, she had a miscarriage. You are as messed up as her. Just keep it to yourself cause you know if all. All right, let's make our way to another one, guys. Okay, how you people support these egotistical liars is beyond me. Uh, someone says, idiot bubblehead. <laughs> idiot bubblehead. All right, let's move on to the next one. You are obvious, you obviously are devoid of all facts and believe the twisted narrative, sad. The twisted narrative where Harry and Meghan called out misogyny, racism, and xenophobia, the twisted narrative where the UK tabloid media has harassed them for six years, made up lies, and gaslit them? That twisted narrative? The twisted narrative where me talking about how I'm proud of two humanitarians 
And I'm sad that their country showed them racism. The narrative where a bunch of people come to defend a bunch of irreputable behavior. That narrative. Okay, I'm I'm not I'm not gonna. <clears throat> okay, so let's keep going. Harry is a traitor to Great Britain. <laughs> Britain capitalized, great not capitalized. Hera is a traitor to Great Britain. I got some today that were really, um, you know, what's funny is, is I will respond to one and then, you know, my response, of course, is well thought out, proofread so that it doesn't t contain a slew of typos and it's research backed by actual research, like, research from published scientific journals, not the sun or the daily fail. Um, so I will respond to one and I, I guess they don't like intelligent women. So after I respond with a completely level headed response, they will go and jump on another derangers comment, which is just talking drivel and they'll all like each other's posts. And I, I feel like some of these people have multiple accounts. It's like they sign out of one account, come back. You know, maybe they're acting like they're uh, biracial people. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I feel like they're all in their deranger club together. Like, ooh, guys, I found another, sh I found another sugar. Let's go after her, guys. Come on, y'all. Let's go. Let's crawl on out of the underworld together and go over there and talk a bunch of drivel. Come on, y'all. <laughs> next, 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 next. So, uh, a a another person said, this is the reason the whole world hates America. I'm English, and this twat hasn't got a clue. Gibraltar in the UK? Uh, I never said that Gibraltar was uh, a part of the UK. I said that it was a part of, you know, we know that Gibraltar is, um, okay, okay. So let's see. One thing that these people hate is research. So let me go ahead and correct myself. We're going to go ahead and pull up a little Wikipedia here. And we'll read exactly what Gibraltar is and its relation to the UK. So, Gibraltar is a British overseas territory and headland on Spain's south coast. A British overseas territory. So, is Gibraltar a part of the UK? Eh. Pretty much, arguably, we could say, you know what I mean, and this person is just being um, silly. This is the reason the whole world hates America. I'm English, and this twat hasn't got a clue. Gibraltar in the UK? <laughs> okay, moving on. So, next, as a mixed-race British person, you do not speak for us. Please keep your woke political agendas to yourself. my lord oh my lord oh my lord oh my lord oh my lord um so i actually took the time to respond to this one because when someone speaks you know on the level of we share some descent some african descent it touches a part of my heart you know like the whole world are my sisters and brothers uh, all races all backgrounds all parts of society socioeconomic classes, but I do have that little twinge in my heart for people whose ancestors were also raped, pillaged, and carried to the colonies on slave ships. But this one, you know, I, I do know that there exists this culture of people um, pretending to be other people online. So this person says they're a mixed race British person, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. There's no profile picture, and so I don't know. 
Uh, the next one. Oopsies, sugar channel alert. I told you they're going back and talking to their white supremacist Aryan nation friends. Guys, it's another sugar channel. Come on, let's all go on over at the same time and just be indignant together on a stranger's comments on their channel. Come on, guys, let's go. Let's all hop on the crazy bus and go. So Oops, sugar channel alert. I said, oopsies, I see a mob of derangers. Let me go get my fly swat. <laughs> Let me go get the, the raid and the bug spray so I can spray all these cockroaches. Because, Lord, we know y'all multiply like cockroaches. I feel like America has a blaming culture. It's always someone else's fault. That's why I think America gets on with Harry and Meghan. The British point of view is that they profited by hurting both their families. I don't think the UK and US are going to agree on this. <laughs> okay, last one, guys. Last one. I can't be on here all day with this silliness. Um, Did you see... This is from another person. Did you see South Park about Harry and Meghan? They are a joke around the world. They're two clowns. They're two clowns? Okay, again, the misspellings, the, the typos, just guys. Download Grammarly, okay? It's not that hard. The world, they're to clowns, and nobody hates them. It's nobody likes them. Lady, do you live in a make-believe world of the jesters? How much money they're paying you? <sighs> okay, guys. I feel like I shouldn't have to say this again. I feel like people should not have to be defending pure human decency and what is so twisted is that these people think that they are upholding justice at least some of them do others are just sociopaths i think living in the basement munching on cheetos <laughs> getting cheeto dust all over the keyboard there you have it a bunch of trolls as comments read on taken directly from my video supporting harry and megan um, these are their rebuttals. Um, so yeah, that should tell you very, very much. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get some more creative total swingers. So I'm looking forward to you guys' creativity. Until the next time, this is your girl, Najwa. I will see you in the next video. And if you have not already, please take your little finger and go ahead and click that like and subscribe button. Smash the bell so you know whenever I post a video and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye.